Hey yo everyone, welcome back, back to another walk walkthrough episode for the game Kingdom Hearts 2. This is a happy anime cafe manager here. Go on, Roxas, ask her. Reaction commands are you know, used to execute actions according in si accordingly in situations. Approach the accessory shop and the top reaction command will appear. Press triangle to talk to the shop owner. Talk to the accessory shop owner. Oh, hello, Roxas. Re reaction commands appear in various situations and are very helpful. Use reaction commands whenever possible. Oh, it's you, Roxas. Please don't let me down. You used to be one of my favorite customers. I'm not a thief. Okay. It's no fun having everyone suspecting me, you know. Then you've got to find a way to clear her name. The woman at the candy shop is pretty disappointed, too. Roxas, have you seen my cat around? Er. Move the camera with the right analog stick. Press R3 to return to its default position. Press R1 to lock, lock on specific things. When locked on to something, the camera will automatically follow the target. Just lock on to the cat. Locking on is useful when following the target. The camera can be controlled while locked on. Press R1 again to cancel. Thank you, Roxas. Did they steal something from you too? Oh my, yes, yeah, something very important. Just so you know, we didn't do it. I believe you. Thanks for that, ma'am. So what did they take from you? My, my precious... So they stole her precious shit. Looks like the culprit is going around stealing shit. I know anybody could uh, come up with, with it. I just uh, thought it'd be funnier that way. Or just say crap. Someone stole my crap. Looks like the culprit is going around stealing crap. Why crap? Because crap is funnier. And not just crap, but the word crap too. This isn't your average thief. I wonder if Cypher would uh, know anything about this. We gotta talk to him. Come on, to the Sandlot. Sandlot, I remember that movie. Come back there, Blondie. What'd you say? You can give us back the... now. Yeah, you're the only ones who would take it, you know? That was undeniable proof that we totally owned you, lamers. So what did you do? Burn it? Huh, <laughs> not that we need some... to prove that you're losers. Replay. <laughs> now you're talking. I guess if you get on your knees and beg, maybe I'll let it slide. <laughs> Roxas! Alright, get to choose, choose your uh, weapon here. Uh, just checking the time code really quick. Watch your opponent well when he lets his guard down, strikes back. If you do that, you'll be sure to win. 
if I were you, I'd go with the weapon in the middle. Cypher has to pay. The weapon on the right's not bad. You could use it in, in struggle too, so it should be easy to fight with. I'll use a different one. This one has a guard. It defends well against attacks. This will do. You become calmer. Defense plus one. Roxas, focus! The gauge in the bottom right is at the HP gauge. You lose HP when damage is taken, and the battle is over when the HP re reaches zero. The blue gauge in the bottom right is the, the MP gauge. It holds a mysterious power that is not yet available. When you approach a target, an orange mark will appear. Press X to attack. Approach and attack Cypher. Right now I'm trying to remedy myself after sucking so hard on Max Pain. After hitting an enemy with an attack, continue attacking to unleash powerful combos. Press X successfully. Counter an enemy attack with your own, own to parry and nullify the attack. This action is also useful in the defensive stance. Come on. We're playing around and fight. Yeah, keep that dildo of yours in your pants, bitch. You don't know me, dude. I killed Tupac with this struggle bat. The trees are not made, making all those grabby hands. Capture. What am I supposed to capture it with? A Pokeball? We have come for you, my liege. Mysterious enemy, that's all you gotta do. That was close. Well, uh, that's about, about it for this episode. Thanks for watching. Until next time, see ya.